Hi, today I've been hydro dipping my son's trainers, so I thought might as well do me an S10s while we're here. So I'm gonna go to Halfords now, pick me up on the way and uh, get myself some uh, spray paint so I can hydro dip my NS10s. Let's see how they turn out. Also on the way to get Matt is exciting because I've got a new car today. I like to keep you abreast of my car updates, obviously. And so I've got a brand new iPACE, which is fully electric, not used to having an electric car, so that's gonna be a bit of fun. They're quite rapid, so yeah, scare Matt. Okay, I've got some uh, ridiculous fluorescent paint for the speakers. Okay, let's go. Okay, spray paint on board. Let's get back and uh, dip the speakers. Okay, spray cans are at the ready, Matt. Uh, that's Matt, by the way, who normally holds a camera, as you uh, might have seen in some old videos. So now we're gonna go and uh, get hydro dipping. So welcome to Streaky Shed. A new little feature I've got. In here is uh, it's a bit of a work in progress at the moment. I've got a vice, which is nice, it rhymes. I'll, uh, I'll add as we go, you'll see it develop and build. But obviously today I need to hydro dip these little boys. And so they're already sprayed white because I wanted them white in the studio a long time ago. But so what I need to do first of all is uh, take all these bits out and I'm gonna have to strip them back to a box. And then what I wanna do for the hydro dipping is because I wanna dip them like this, I'm gonna have to put something on the back to hold them as they go in. So I'll basically do that and then we'll get on with the dipping. Okay, we're done. Two, oh, <laughs> two blank NS10 boxes. Now time for a dipping. So what we need to do first of all is get some gray primer and primer them up so that the spray paint sticks. So I've got to try and do this without getting myself completely covered in spray paint. We'll see if I now. Oh, no. Let's go. Right, got a tub. This is what I'm going to dip them in, but obviously it's filthy, so you need to clean this up. Now, fill it with, I'm going to fill it fully with water because this is where we're going to dip from. I didn't consider the fact it would be really heavy. <laughs> right, put the camera down, you're going to have to carry it with me. So next stage is stage 80, seems like it's been going on forever and it's about to rain, is to uh, put the spray in the water. So let the water calm down, spray them, hopefully they're dry and we'll be off on them. So they're going to be uh, pink really, aren't they? Oh, I can I touch them on the bottom. Oh no, kind of cool. That's a good section. So where should I put that? That one, that looks cool in that corner, isn't it? Okay, let's let these, let these dry. So that's how you turn a boring old NS10 into some epic looking speakers. How good do these look? They've come out so well. All this stuff here is glow in the dark paint. So they're fluorescent and glow in the dark. All this stuff around here, you can't see too much, but it's got all little glitter fleckles in. So there's glitter across the front. I mean, they just look insane compared to the old boring ones. So definitely it's worth a go. Get an old shoe, get anything, uh, not your dog, obviously, and uh, dip that in some spray paints and get your stuff looking as epic as this. So if you've liked this video, don't forget to thumb it up and subscribe because the bigger we can get the channel, the more crazy stuff we can do. So thanks for watching. Until next time, get hydro dipping. So don't forget to like this, so, uh,
So don't forget to like and subscribe the video because the more... Uh, oh.